Hello YouTube, Geezer here. The rest of the gang's in classy there, getting ready to go. That's right, this is our last morning here at uh, Pioneer Trails RV Park. We'll be departing here, oh, within the hour. But last night we had a wonderful evening in town Anacortes, Washington. Starting with a, a wonderful, fresh seafood dinner at a, a bayside restaurant with a nice panoramic view of Padillo Bay, followed by um, the crowning jewel of this leg. Uh, we headed over to Island Adventures Charter for an evening cruise and whale watching around the San Juan Islands. And uh, that was just spectacular. Uh, Lucy's had this desire to be with wild whales ever since I've known her. And I've, I've known her for 47 or 48 years. And she has always talked about wanting to be out with, uh, with the whales. I don't know what it is, she can't explain it. But anyway, it was a very important thing for us to do on this trip. Uh, what? Oh yeah, I took you along. Uh, we'll get to that. Uh, I just wanted to uh, to offer uh, a little tip in case anybody is planning or, or ever plan to come up to this area and, and possibly take one of these charter cruises. Um, the uh, the regular price for this five hour cruise and whale watching excursion, uh, the evening one now out of Anacortes, is a hundred nine dollars a head. There is a ten dollar discount for seniors sixty five and over. But here's here's the tip: if you take the Wednesday evening cruise, which is what we did. Um, the price for all adults is 79 bucks. I mean, that's a substantial discount. Uh, the, the discount that we got uh, virtually paid for dinner. So, uh, just something to keep in mind that that's, that's really the time to go. But, uh, anyhow, uh, I put together a little hybrid photo and, and, uh, video montage and uh, I hope you enjoy it. Uh-oh, I spotted one already. There you go. Yeah. Well, let's get in line. Get checked in.
Okay, we're in our uh, lot that they provide for RVs and boats, boat trailers. There we are right there. And right over here is where we're going. Uh, what we did for the girls, keep them comfortable. It's really not very hot today, probably mid to upper 60s. And it's uh, about 3.30 in the afternoon, so it's going to start cooling off even more. But uh, we left uh, the upper bunk windows, we cranked them open, and uh, the front and rear roof vents are open. We closed everything else, but that'll allow quite a little bit of ventilation in there. And uh, they'll be fine. So, no worries there. Uh, closed all the curtains so they sun couldn't get in, they couldn't see out. They were already curled up on the beds when we uh, left the camper, so so we're good. We're just looking for the spot where we're supposed to uh, meet the captain of the boat, which is probably right over there where that group of people is. Right over there. So we're going to head that way. See you probably on the boat. Free life rafts. Right now, of course, at that point, we continue our wildlife viewing from the comfort of those little orange rafts. Right, keep in mind, guys, we've never needed any of that stuff before. I highly doubt that we're going to need it today, but the Coast Guard does mandate that we point out where all of those. 